I feel the need to tell you guys that this is fake. Anyway. <laughs> All right, y'all. So, recently, I think maybe like a month ago-ish, not even a month, maybe like a few weeks ago, I was on Twitter and I saw these, these amazing freaking Mondoogies and um, some, some really, really courageous, oh, I'm gonna choke, choked on my hair. Some really courageous Mon BBs decided that um, they were going to basically spray paint their light stick. And those photos are so cute that I decided I will try to spray paint mine too. I'm so fucking scared you guys because who knows what could happen. Like sis, like if it doesn't turn on after that, I don't know what I'm gonna do because the world tour is coming back soon and I'm trying to go and I want my light stick to work, y'all. I want my light stick to work. We are just going to keep it pushing and <laughs> pray for me. Pray for me. So you guys, today I will basically be showing you how I spray paint it. I'm very much just going off of just absolutely nothing like of truly like bitch like someone help me <laughs> i'm so scared so this is the last time we'll see it black bye black mondungi we will miss you you were with me for two whole concerts bad bitch in the making and hopefully you will be with me and working for the third fourth and fifth and whatever how many uh world tours monster x wants to have I so first of all, let me say, I actually decided not to get spray paint because I wanted a very highlighter pink and I didn't see a highlighter pink for the spray paint. So I got this colored paint, it's so light. Let me see, this colored paint, it's like highlighter paint, right? Highlighter pink. On top of that, because um, the, um, you know, once we go into the concert, if I, when I go, hopefully, hopefully I can get P1 tickets, but that's not what I'm complaining about today. <laughs> that's not what I'm talking about. Once you go into the venue, it's of course going to be dark. So, I might have slapped and I got glow in the dark, like conceal it. And so I put this over the paint and it'll make my pink glow in the dark, which I hope works. Hopefully this works. I'm kind of scared, but yeah, hopefully it will actually show up. Another thing with this pink, hopefully this pink will show up, will go over the black. Oh my God, I'm so scared about this. I really hope this actually takes and works because if it works the way I want it to work, my light stick is going to be banging, you guys. The regular light stick is already like this high. Mine's gonna be like, Colossal. I'm so excited. But yeah, you guys, um, I'm going to take my lashes off and then I'm just going to basically start. So you guys are just going to see me paint. There's no reason for me to talk. I'm just going to paint. Let's go. <laughs> So at this point, it's the next day. This is kind of how the first layer of this looks. But you guys, literally, like it's kind of a mess. Guess what I found on my break yesterday? Pink spray paint and it's kind of the color that I wanted. It even kind of matches this. So I'm really excited and um, honestly, I think if you continue like to layer, you can get a good base with like craft paint but it takes so much longer and i would just much rather spray paint it so that is what i'm going to be doing for the rest of it so first i will be kind of hiding the parts that i'm supposed to hide so basically hiding this and the monster x i might have to let go of these lines on the end the really small ones might not be able to hide that but I will try to hide as much as possible and 
respray paint. I almost want to even just scratch this off, but I don't really think it'll affect anything. So let's go. finished product I think it turned out really nice but I there's a lot of things I kind of wanted to really quickly go over with you guys about the new product because this was crazy trial and error for me and um, yeah I just feel like it would be bad if I just kind of left things unresolved and I really want to tell you guys the things I messed up on so you won't mess up on it so first ignore how beat I look actually don't ignore how beat I look because this took a good two hours so don't ignore that but uh, ignore how crazy my makeup is it's for a Instagram post so um, if you don't follow me on Instagram you should go do that but yeah so talking about Miss Light Stick over here this is very cute and hot pink oh my god I just I really love how it looks from afar but um so first, let's just talk about the things I definitely messed up on, which is a lot. Um, first things first is I did not do too well with masking the top of this. Like from afar, it looks fine, but definitely when you get up close, you see the marks where I really just did not care too much about taping. And I think that's because since it's like a cylinder and it's like a weird cylinder, it was really hard just to wrap it around, which is what I was thinking. But literally, if I was just the slightest bit um, more particular or like, you know, a like a perfectionist, you can just cut out the little triangles and it will be way more easier and you can probably have it a way cleaner line than I do. But honestly, since this is like the first time I've done something like this, I kind of am okay with the little mess ups and the little wrong things about it. It's just a cute little customization for me and I literally use this light stick about once a year. <laughs> Another thing is you guys know that I painted it first and then I found the spray paint. Painting over it gave it really weird like textures like as you can see because from the paint under it so it doesn't look like a nice flat surface like I'd like it to look. Honestly half of my problems or mess ups on this light stick would be solved if I just had waited and ordered um, a glow in the dark pink spray paint instead of going to Michaels and just getting paint. For sure, I think if you really want this to look nice and very, very like, you know, you bought it like pink, you know, like very per perfect, then um, you should for sure use spray paint and you should for sure, um, if you want it to glow in the dark like how mine's is, there's literally glow in the dark colors and it glows pink instead of this one which actually will glow green because I got a top coat for it instead of like a actual pink glow in the dark paint because I couldn't find that either. I digress. Um, another thing is at the top 
as you guys can see okay well I messed it up just a little bit now here but I'll try and fix it later um, I think from afar it looks like a, a good enough monster X sign and I know some people might think this looks a little messy I very much just cut it out I didn't even try to like um, get it completely perfect a good way to do that is to put tape on it and then like draw it out the shape in sharpie and then cut that out but sis again I was just kind of you know doing whatever so this does glow in the dark like I said I don't have any video because it's really hard to get a glow and get capture glow in the dark on video which I don't know why I forgot that but I did I will try to take a photo of it on my iPhone later um, another thing about glow in the dark stuff is that it charges with like actual with light or UV light a really easy way to test it out is the flashlight on the back of your phone you can just really quickly charge it literally just go over your light stick and then go into the dark and it will be brighter but also um, the sunlight charges it and of course uh, the day I have to test it there's like barely any sun out and it's been rainy this whole weekend so let's hope this charges it enough and again I will put a photo of how it looks my last real big thing to talk about is the home the the button to light up your light stick um, for me I literally just went over the button because I kind of felt like I shouldn't but um, because even in the photo that I had saw the reference photo they had like little stickers over their home their little button pressy thing and so I kind of felt like something was off but I just went over it anyway yeah there's a reason why you should not paint your button if you do it will like get stuck when you press it and it will literally just be stuck down so for sure before you spray paint anything put like a little sticker or something to cover it up and keep it protected and I would just leave a sticker over it so it would still look nice and not look weird with just you know the random black button and yeah I think that is it I hope you guys liked this video um, if you also spray paint or try to attempt to paint your light sticks it doesn't even have to be monster X if you want to paint any of your light sticks for sure tag me in photos I would love to see and I hope you guys like this video. Remember to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it.